Hey guys, it's Marcus here and welcome back to AffiliateMarketingDude.com and our special video series where we are setting up our hub site. And you'll remember in the last video we started setting up AffiliateOffers.net and we were learning how to do HTML, links, images, and everything like that. Now a lot of people were asking me, Marcus, why are we doing this if we can just set everything up on WordPress? Well, one of the things I wanted to teach you was the basics of HTML and how it works because it works in conjunction with the WordPress and with the hub site that we're building. So now that you know how to build a page, a lot of the difficult things have been paved out of the way and you now know a lot more than you did before you started this video series. Very, very important because we're going to use this and we're going to build on this knowledge as web marketers very 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 important to have as part of your information toolkit alright so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and set up WordPress on this domain but first what I wanna do is I wanna show you obviously this is what it looks like with our turkey our offer and our um, AdSense here as well now one thing that we wanna do is just go to Google out of curiosity and type in site colon your site Dot com or dot net. Now the reason we do this is to see if Google actually has indexed it and you can see here it has right here we are top affiliate program networks affiliate offers dot net so ready to go it's indexed pretty cool so next what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to our host gator control panel and we're gonna scroll down this is what your control panel looks like we've been here before we're gonna scroll down to files again we're gonna to go to file manager now remember what we did in the last uh, video is we actually created the images or the icons folder the Marcus folder and our index file so what we're gonna do first and foremost is we're gonna click on the index and we are going to rename it okay and we're gonna rename it from index.htm to test page .htm. okay now what that's gonna do you'll notice it's going to change affiliateoffers.net and remove this page and just have an index okay that's what we want you should be looking at this right here as an index and if you want to look at your test page you just click test page and you're ready to go okay now the reason we did that is because we are now going to install our hub site WordPress this is where we are gonna put all our trackers our scripts our codes everything like that where everything is going to lead from all right, so what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down to software right down here, and we're going to go to quick install. Okay, we click quick install, and we're going to go ahead and choose WordPress over here, continue, and we're going to choose our domain, affiliateoffers.net. We're going to keep this blank because we want it to be our index page we want it to be affiliateoffers.net bam they go to the blog all right so we're gonna set this up here quick install admin email this is where you put your email all right like this put our blog title and then um, what you want to do also uh, is put your keywords in here okay so put your keywords as your blog title okay if you're using just a hub site like Marcus's fun site just put welcome to Marcus's fun site if you are using something like affiliate offers definitely put the words affiliate offers in there all right we're gonna do admin user admin first name Marcus last name blogman all right install now and we install it all right now once it gives us a congratulations page what you're gonna notice is now our index page when we refresh it goes to our blog setup page okay so here's our blog page we're ready to go now the blog has taken over the actual site okay but I want to show you something very important and that is that when you go into your file manager you're going to notice that test page icons Marcus icons CGI bin are all still here okay so you can actually have a blog and different pages on the same domain name this is very important when it gets to redirects and scripts and codes and things like that 
Okay, so you'll just notice it just put WP Admin Content Includes, FTPs, HT Access, and a bunch of other pages related to WordPress. Okay, don't touch that stuff, but you can touch, you know, the other stuff that you've made. My advice is put it in a different folder. Okay, so I could create a different folder. Uh, let's say I wanted to uh, make an ad place where I put all my ads. Okay, I could and do new folder, ad place or whatever. Okay, and then I could just create everything in ad place, put all my stuff in here. Okay, you could do that with basically anything. If you had videos, you could put them in videos, everything. This stuff can be on the web as well as have a blog on the same thing. That's why we're setting up this, this basic site okay so now we have our WordPress here we're ready to go um, what we want to do next is go ahead and install some plugins and some themes and things like that and the way that we go about doing that is going to our admin area okay so we're gonna go to our site.com slash WP admin right like this and we'll type in our username oh, make sure our caps lock is off there we go put our password in hit login and now we are on our regular basic WordPress admin page. Now you'll notice several different things in the black areas is your menus and different things like that to change stuff. And then across the top you have your notifications and here you have like different things like okay what's going on on your blog. Okay what we're interested in is this stuff over here on the side. Now first and foremost what we want to do is go to appearance themes. Okay, we're going to install a theme, that way we're not stuck with this ugly, weird looking theme here. So what I'm going to do is below this video um, on affiliate marketingdude.com is I'm going to put some themes and templates for you from my private stash. So we're going to go here and we are going to go to add new, right like this, and we'll do upload themes. Okay, we want to upload a theme, we're going to click browse. We're going to find those files that we just downloaded from the site. All right. And I'm going to use Buffman. All right. That's got our muscly guy here. We'll hit install. After we install it, hit activate, right like this. And then once it's activated, you're going to notice that, let's see here, you're going to notice that your blog now looks quite different. All right. Welcome to Affiliate Offers. Just another WordPress. Hello and all this stuff over here. Okay, so now what we want to do is want to practice working with this specific type of site, which is WordPress. Okay, so first and foremost, what we're going to do is we're going to go install some other stuff, okay? So we are going to go back to our WordPress. Then we're going to go to plugins, add new. Okay, now there's several plugins that I like to use and we'll have links to those below. We're going to go to upload plugin and first and foremost I'm going to go to my plugins folder right like this we have several of them here we are going to put on widget control right like this okay and widget control is going to allow you to control uh, all the sidebar stuff here uh, put opt-ins make it to where different sidebars can be on different parts very very important plugin uh, that I use all the time this is one that I created Okay, we'll go ahead and activate that. Next, we're going to go, and you'll notice that widget control pops up down here. Okay, so you can edit it and everything, and then it's also here. All right, very, very important. Next, we're going to go ahead and add new, and we're going to upload one again. And we are going to upload, let's see here, we're going to upload... It's a zip file. Okay, so we're going to get uh, CB Affiliate Control. Let's see, we'll get this one here. Right like that. Okay, that's going to control our ClickBank links. And again, this is our hub. That's why we're putting all the plugins here. Because as our hub, we're going to want to track everything. Okay, next we're going to go here. Upload. All right, like this. Browse, we're going to get easy blog ads. There we go, easy blog ads here. Install. Okay. 
Okay. Activate. Right like this. Okay, add new. And we're going to go to our tracker plugin. Upload. Right like this. Browse. And we're going to do Marcus's solo tracker. Let's see where we're at. There we go. I believe that's the latest one and install and then we can install more as we go along uh, one other one i'd like to install is our redirection plugin and then we'll be done with plugins and what i'm going to do is i'm going to put links to all this stuff below uh, if you want to get all the plugins that i have that i use then you can click the link below and get my list of plugins now the way that this works is we are giving you a special discount on the plugins as well as all the new plugins Okay, so instantly you're getting access to all these plugins here. You can see you could go through and download each one instantly, and you'll get a password to this. Obviously, this is password protected area. Uh, but right after you uh, join, you're not only going to get all these plugins, which usually I charge for 47 to a couple hundred dollars each, and uh, you're going to get all these instantly, but you're also going to get new ones every month as I come out with them and test them and release them. They're just going to show up in here automatically. So you're going to get those all the time uh, for just 17 bucks a month as well, which is a killer deal. So awesome stuff. We're going to have a link to the plugins below. Um, that way you can get all the plugins and use them as I am as well. And it's got pretty much everything you need to be able to market online like me. So awesome stuff. We got that plugin. The last one we're going to do is the redirection plugin and we're good to go. Now you'll see that we have CB affiliate control, monetize text, redirection, widget control, solo tracker, and we are ready to go. Now you can put all the stuff that you want in here. Um, all the good tools and everything, and we are going to work with them. So go ahead and install the WordPress, change the file name as we said, do everything you learned in this video, uh, get the plugins, install the plugins, and come back for the next video. I'm going to post it right below this one on affiliatemarketingdude.com. And I hope you're enjoying this video series. Uh, follow along because you're going to start to understand everything and make it a lot easier on yourself to profit online. Thanks again for listening and I'll see you in the next video below.